Now it is time for some home design tips from the amazing Hamish Dodd. He's joining us now in the Harvey Norman Lounge. Morning, Hamish. Good morning. So nice to be in the lounge. A bit of an upgrade. Usually we put you on the stool. I know. Yes. Normally perched up the top up there. No, well, you deserve it today because you're talking about, you know, beautiful furnishings. What have you got today? That's right. We're talking about curtains and the spin on this is they're from Rosine. Wow. What, is that a new thing? Because I didn't think Rosine did curtains. It, it is new. Uh, so what they've done is they've taken a range of curtains that complement Rosine colours. Um, so by doing this, they're allowing you to go into the Rosine store and sort of be a bit more of a one-stop shop because people can have an issue when it comes to choosing curtains and colour that matches and goes well together. Fair enough too. Okay. Nice. OK, well, let's have a look at some of the examples that they've got. That's right. I mean, there are a lot of examples available. So we've picked seven to run through. So you can see you can get bold colours. There's lots of Ooh, patterns. that's nice. That's right. And, and you know, you got, the good thing is here, you're right. What they do is they've got all the wall colours that you want. And yep. now in that same shop, you can now choose the curtains, which is going to match it. So you can go for a plain curtain. Do they do patterns? Do they do stripes? Patterns, stripes and neutrals. And the neutrals are great because, I mean, realistically, they're going to have a place for everybody. The yeah. fun thing about them is that they are ready-made. So you can measure your curtain yourself, your, you know, your space that you want it to go into. Yes. Pop along to the Resine store, pick which ready-made you like. It'll be made for you and then take it away. Excellent. Hang it up. I, I, I want to ask you, you might not be able to answer this though. Yes. When you're measuring your curtains, yes. how far, like, what do you have to actually measure? <laughs> from the That's top? what I was going <laughs> to ask as well. Yeah. It's the never ending saga yeah. of when you're measuring curtains. Well, it all depends on um, what look you're going for. I personally like my curtains to just touch the floor. Okay? Right. Some people like them to hang on to the floor a bit, so you might add 10, 15 mil to the drop height. Yeah. You need to think about where you're going to mount your curtain. Yeah. rail as well, uh, whether or not you're going to go right up high and have it up near the ceiling. Mm -hmm. um, please don't do it halfway between. Oh, nice. whoops. Yeah. I go to my house. <laughs> let's, run okay. on the, let's run on the third, the third, the third thing. So, you know, 150mm, 200mm ups, nice, um, you know, from so the you top don't, of the So you don't have your curtain just past the window sill. You make sure it goes further oh, down. Oh, crikey, George. <laughs> no. Now... <laughs> By goodness. Evens. Okay, so curtains, yes. they run to the floor. Yes. Uh, yeah, okay. Now, if you ha should have a window, um, I'd, I'd prefer it if you bought a blind for there. And Resine will, um, with their mm -hmm. partners, actually custom make you Roman blinds in the same fabric. So, this is the next thing. You can get them as ready maids, but yes. should you want, they can send someone out to do a proper measure. Make them in the style you want. Good. And then it, it's, it's more of a long-winded process. Yeah, sure, I, 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 I would do it if you can afford to do it. That's yep. great. But then uh, are ready-made. They're cost-effective, and you know it, it's, it's it works for some people. Um, tell me about pleats because they're very. Yes, I know. Well, you're the on moment. the pleating thing going on there. Aren't you? Yeah. So okay. They um, this, they're offering you three different pleats. So they're offering a, um, a pencil pleat an inverted pleat or a Dutch pleat. What's a pencil pleat? Okay, pencil then... pleat is the one that most people would know when it's just all just gathered across the top in yep. little pieces. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, reverse pleat is when the fold is on the front and the pleat is on the back, so you get a oh, yep. wider section across yep. the front. I'm with you. Uh, du uh, which is reverse or inverted, two names are the same thing. Dutch pleat, okay, that's when you have two little pleats and then you have a flat bit and two more little pleats and then a flat bit, right? right. Okay. Those are your options. Personal favourite, I like an inverted or reverse pleat. Probably Dutch pleat. I'm not such a huge fan of pencil pleat. Okay, well, is that on trend at the moment? That's what well, it is. Chain. Well, because I'm Hamish saying says it so. is. Yeah. <laughs> Hamish says it is. That's, that's, it that's where I would be heading. If you wanted that sort of look, I think it's a nice, clean look to the heading. And right. we've seen a lot of of the examples that Rosine have. No yes. doubt, in store they have a whole lot more. Are you impressed with what they've got? I am. There seems to be something for everyone. I mean, this is the thing. You look at a whole range of stuff, and you, it, if I showed you, you'd go, "I like that one. I don't like that one. I like that one, etc." Mm. So. They, they have covered all the bases, which is really good. And I quite like stripes and curtains, so there we go. Yeah. Nice would you go for a really bold pattern? Where would you go for a bold pattern? Well, I mean, you can use a bold pattern if you have, um, shall we say, a more neutral lounge suite and other furnishings in the room to give you a bit of impact. Whereas if you're going to bring the impact with your furniture, yeah. you're probably going to want to have something a little more neutral on the wall. Should your curtains match your wall colour or should they, should they complement it? <laughs> I, I say complement it. I, I mean, if you're putting them up, you're putting them up, you want to have something there. And yeah. um, you've got to think about what they're going to look like when they're closed. 
uh, you know, yeah, okay. it's, it's, it's add some impact. You can never it. come to my place because it's all a bit beige, actually, in the current department. Oh, I'm sure the fabrics and the couches and everything are lovely. Uh, Sounds like a makeover date. Yeah. Hey? Oh, it would be great for yeah. a makeover, actually. <laughs> yeah. Perfect. Hey, yeah. well, thank you so much, Hamish. Awesome. And nice to see Rosina's complimenting their already fantastic wall colours with now curtains and different fabrics and different styles and different colours. You can go and get the look at rosine.co.nz. Thank you very much, Hamish. We'll see you next time. Thank you.